John soon realized he had been unwittingly thrust into the dark and dangerous world of the Chinese underworld, the influential and notorious Pingong Gang. Loyalty to the gang was necessary, or the consequences would be ruthless. But John Jo saw potential in the young orphan, and despite his size, he knew he could be of use. Don't go back to work, he told Willis. From now on, you stay out here. He handed him $500 and said, get rid of those terrible clothes. My boys are taking you shopping. John was grateful for the transformation that had taken place in his life. He was thankful for the new crew of people who treated him like a brother, the warm house he had to sleep in, and the food always available. He was allowed to get custom fitted suits, a pager, and a cell phone, and was taught how to style his hair to fit in with the other guys. 